much. Wow, well, I was talking about those anchors now. You've got that stern anchor out the back. That's what holds her on her stern. You've got these two breast wires up front here. These are what holds the dredge. And you got the two swings on the side. Those are where those tanks are. And that's how she pulls herself back and forth. So you're just, you're just you're moving it by pulling in on the anchor. Exactly. Okay. That's what the Lieberman's doing. He's he's moving the winches. Okay. That that wind the wires up. It'll bring us back and forth. So, so the cutter head stays in one place and the, the whole dredge moves. itself moves. Back. Correct. And she moves forward by pulling herself on these two anchors out front. You'll see where these these two yellow buoys are. These can buoys out there. One yep. on the left there and one there. Yes. Those are both anchors. And so after she makes a pass one way, she'll pull ahead four feet, come back. Pull ahead four feet, come back. And just goes back and forth like that. After a while, once she's moved past the range of where she can pull, we'll get this anchor bar, she's over there. That'll go to each one of these anchors, pick them up and move them forward for her. Um, got about 1,800 feet of float hose behind the dredge. Uh, there's a pipe that runs into the main pump out the side and then the sand gets pumped through that rubber hose. That rubber hose is like our leash. Um, you know, we've got about an 1,800 foot leash. So after we reach the max of it, which we just did, see how right now there's some slack in it, it kind of makes a mess? Yeah. Uh, we had moved back to another cut because once we start moving forward, we'll run out of slack and then we gotta move back. And all those anchors we saw out there, the five anchors that hold the dredge, this is where he can control all the winches to so pull himself back and forth or pull himself ahead. He's got all the, his cameras up here of all those winches so he can keep track of the wires, see how much he's letting out. Right here. <laughs> now, how long have you been a lever man? 41 years. 41? Yeah, June 73. He's getting the hang of it. <laughs> yeah. You got it figured out yet? No, excuse me. Yeah, no, oh, more. that nasty shadow. That old man that broke me in, it was 44 years, he told me. He said, today you'll dig this material and it'll be all right. Tomorrow, you go dig the same material and it ain't going to be all right. And he's right. Changes every day. Uh, I don't care what survey says, what production engineer said, you got to sit down in this giant digging and then learn. The only way I can see it.